go, 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 go. Hey up. Move, move, move. Now go get it. Still too slow. dynamics a little bit with coaching special teams and, and how that's worked uh, so far in camp? Yeah, we have, uh, really we have all the coaches involved in it. Coach Gibson and Coach Leffitz kind of take the offensive and defensive units, but the way we break it down, you know, there's four or five coaches involved with every special teams unit. I'm involved with them, and I like it because it makes me interact to, with all the guys instead of just one side of the ball. So, uh, so far I've been pleased with uh, how much we've got in. You know, the hard part about special teams is hard to go live during camp, you know, particularly with the kickoff and kickoff returns. But uh, we'll be getting a lot of reps in them. We'll, we'll go uh, live maybe in our scrimmage on Saturday with it and see where we're at. Does it keep guys accountable a little bit more when you have, you know, five sets of eyes watching different things? Oh, I think so. And I think also it makes, it shows a, the sense of importance when, when you got your coordinators involved in it and, and everything like that. I think it's, the guys see that there's a, it's a whole team effort. And, and uh, you know, everybody talks about the third of the game. And you know, I don't know how many plays exactly it is, but there's no question for us right now, you know, we've, we've got to be able to make some plays in the special teams and be really solid there to have a chance. Well, we've moved uh, Bushlew and Greg Nwoko over. Bushlew's healthy, Greg's not. Hopefully he'll be back in a couple of days. We moved them permanently over to linebacker. Um, and then Timey is playing both. I mean, he's getting a lot of reps, which is good because it'll it'll help get him in shape. But he's he's still going to be a you know a big part of our offense. But the more reps he's getting on defense, the more he's going to look like he's going to play over there for us there as well. Is that something you've always been comfortable with in the past, moving guys from one spot if you play yeah, another? Yeah, yeah, almost out of necessity. I've always had to. I've never really had guys that, that played both ways. You know, we had guys like uh, we had Pac-Man that, that would run some plays on offense and all that, but nothing like like Tommy's doing, but it makes more sense to do it now, especially where we're at, um, you know, with our numbers and, and how thin we are. And, and thankfully, he's he's jumped in full speed and, and has really looked pretty good at it.